garlic, common garlic. You find it in your kitchen cabinet at the grocery store. Here's a few things you might not know about garlic. And I'm talking Allium sativum. Now this is an herb that's been used like for 6,000 years. It's long, long history in traditional Chinese medicine, TCM. The ancient Egyptians used it as a medicine and in cooking. Uh, it's obviously been used throughout um, Africa, uh, India, right? The, you know, Asia. It's just been this powerfully available. Europe, right? Mediterranean. I didn't say those already, right? This is a plant that's been around. And let's face it, it fights vampires. So why would we not be using garlic? So... It's especially famous for its ability to prevent and fight infections. It can help in traditional Chinese medicine. It's also recognized not only for this fighting of infection capability, which is also recognized in the West, but it's very clearly identified with toxicity, clearing out toxins. And this is toxins, whether they're germs, right? Antimicrobial, meaning antiviral, bacterial, fungus, yeast, uh, molds, right? help rinse it away, environmental factor toxins, and even just poor dietary choices. So this is a great one to have around if you just know you've kind of been going on a binge or you've been over-celebrating or whatever's been taking place to kick you off of a good cleanse diet. Garlic comes in and helps rinse that all away. You may not know that attribute of it being like a clear toxin. It is also in traditional Chinese medicine recognized as anti-parasitic. So you can imagine how important in cultures where they have warm, damp things and where people were living close to the land for thousands of years to have something that could help prevent parasites was a big deal. It's a known quantity for that. It's been studied for that. Um, it also is known for moving blood, helping prevent stagnation, helping to get the blood where it needs to be in your body. And it's also used for promoting lactation. Bet you didn't know that. Um, modern studies have absolutely confirmed garlic's ability for promoting heart health, countering infections, fighting cancer, um, and preventing inflammation. And inflammation causes a whole host of problems if it hangs around for too long in the body. Research uh, that was done at the University of Copenhagen have shown that garlic was very, very effective for fighting bacteria that was known to cause a variety of lung conditions, including cystic fibrosis, um, including pneumonia, bone infections, and even sepsis. That's big time medicine. So go get some garlic. Start figuring out how you can be using it. There's so many ways. Visit our website at whiterabbitinstituteofhealing.com. Consider our herb course on garlic and find out some of these nuances and how to make use of it. And if you've got a question or comment, please leave it below. I'd love to hear from you.